Welcome back everyone. Hi guys. We are back doing the Monty. Full Monty. No, not really. Yeah, Monty. <laughs> I think it's been... I know long. there's another meaning to the Full Monty. How long has it been? I don't know. And even though I've got the same clothes on, it's just last Tuesday. Yeah. Oh, so it's been a week then. About a week. No, Saturday, last Saturday. Last Saturday. Is it just over a week, guys? Yeah. But the yeah, weather hasn't been too good. No, yet. the weather hasn't been that nice. But today is but absolutely But today glorious. is... What is it today? It's the 2nd second, of November. 2nd of November. It's absolutely mm. beautiful. It's cold, but lovely. Yeah. Um, so we're doing our next... Yeah, we're doing the next five miles. Butting, um, Buttington Wharf. Buttington Wharf to... 81 is the page. I'm not going to be able to pronounce. Oh, you're going back What's the other it? way. All right, yeah. 81. To... Um, where's me? <laughs> to... B-B-B-E-R-R-I-E-W. Biru. Biru. Biru Aqueduct. Yeah, we're going to there. It's about five mile walk today. It's about half eleven. Clocks yeah. have gone back. So we haven't got much light, mm. so let's get... Andy's just finished work and dropping us off. Um, hopefully he don't fall asleep on the way back. But yeah, he's yeah. a bit tired. It's he's not going to be doing any fishing today. No, no. The trouble is he's got to come and get us again now, so it's like a two hour mm, 32 minutes trip, here, maybe. 32 minutes back, then 42 minutes to pick us up and 42 minutes back. Yeah, so, but yeah, it's the only way we be at, can do it anyway, because mm. he's too I tired. I said sleep in the car, but he doesn't want to do that. Did you ask him? Yeah. Did you say to him? No, he can't do that. No. So, um, yeah, but we're really looking forward to this. Because yesterday, well, yesterday wasn't too bad, Josh, was it? But the day before was, uh, Halloween was a wash... God, gal, blowing a gal. Yeah, it's an absolute gale, yes. We haven't had rain for weeks, proper rain like that, have we? Yeah. So, so but this video will be coming out in January, probably. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, because we've got to do uh, two more sections after this mm. still. So, but we let's do get that? on with it because yep, we were going to stop at um, Poise. What's the. Poise, Poise Castle, but I think. I don't think maybe, we have time. I think maybe we'll go there with Andy. But if we do, if we go there in the future, <laughs> before this video's out, I'll put it in this video. Yeah. All right, so yeah, let's get let's, on. Let's go and the explore. Wow, another absolutely beautiful mooring spot. Wow, sometimes it's really weird to see a narrowboat on a canal that's not even restored yet. But this is a trip boat and it's for people with disabilities. It takes them on trips down to Welshbourne back. Oh, if only we could see it moving though. This is bridge 117 as you come into Welshpool and as you can see this to the left is where the channel used to go but there's no bridge there but luckily this road goes on a slight incline so instead of doing a new bridge there they've dug the channel up to the right there and they've gone under the road where the road goes up a hill so they can build a bridge and this bridge doesn't have a towpath either 
So it's almost like a tunnel, and as you can see, most of the work is done. This whole 12 mile section is navigable. There's no restrictions, there's no obstacles. If anything, it needs a little bit of a dredge and a cut back, but this whole area is done. As we enter Welshpool, there's really not much left that gave you the impression that the canal was very important to this town, which it was. There used to be lime kilns, dry docks, wharfs, a gas works, and plenty of factories, all of which have gone. So we've made it to Welsh Pool Wharf, haven't yes, we? Yes, we have. Hopefully one day we'll be able to moor here and go, go into B&M, get our gas, go into Audi, get our shopping. Yeah, because you've got moorings over there. Mm. Yeah, moorings behind us. Looks so, like free, and it? there's water here, I think. Yeah, it's brilliant. Yeah. Got facilities point, even a, um, a slipway there. Yeah, slipway. That's probably the only proper slipway on this um, Canal. Yeah. I don't know if you get Olive in there though, a bit too long isn't it, not enough room to get out. <laughs> you wouldn't be able to come across here for a small boat or like a GRP cruiser mm. maybe, but yeah, not, but, I don't think we'll get a lot of yeah, Olive in into Welshpool now. Yeah. Quite a nice boat at the moment really isn't it? Yeah, looks alright. Mm. Aldi right on the There's doorstep. There's not much that is left from the canal area though. No. Unfortunately, but it's still nice. But yeah, let's continue. This is the old single gauge railway bridge that went into the main town of Welshpool. No way, what are the odds? How great is this to see a moving boat on this isolated canal? As you can see, there's actually a narrow boat going through. Yes. This is the, um, it's the boat we saw earlier. They yeah. do trips. I don't know. For, I think it's. I don't know if it is just for disabled. I think it might be just for disabled people. I'm not sure. I'll have to look. Yeah, up. That's, that is such a cool sight to see. Yeah. Isn't it? Because we yeah, thought it would be over now, wouldn't it? Yeah, we thought it would be over this mm. time of year. To come onto the aqueduct, and then he's going to turn around. I think he's going to reverse back now. So, we've made it to Hollybush Wharf, haven't we? Yeah, Hollybush Wharf. And this behind us is the Canal Museum. Yeah, it's Poisland Museum and Montgomery Canal Centre. Although we do not have time at the moment to go in there because we've got such little light now and the clocks have gone back and we only, we caught here at bloody half eleven, so yeah. And I think we've just gone over L-L-E-D-A-N hmm. Brook Aqueduct. But it was a treat seeing the boat. Oh because yeah. It, it, it turns like, round back there, and if we didn't stop in Welsh no. Wharf, we wouldn't have seen that. No, and so it's that was a, amazing. Um, there's two boats, Hallwind, Hallwind one and two, and they're adapted for people who have physical disabilities. Mm. And that's been in operation since 1976, guys. Yeah. So and it still hasn't joined up. Oh well. There one was day. also fishing here. Yeah, but we've got a 
lock behind us, the first lock of the yeah. day. Don't know what it's called. Yeah, we, we might don't find know out what it's called it. when we go up there because yeah. there's nothing on the book. Might be Hollybush Lock. I don't yeah. Know. We'll Holly see. Bush but yeah. Lock. All right, so let's go have a little look, shall we? In 1969 there were plans to convert the bed of the canal through Welshpool into a road and the Welshpool Bypass Action Committee was formed to oppose this. They requested the help of the Shropshire Union Canal Society to organise a big dig. The big dig was attended by 200 volunteers who cleared a section of the canal. Whilst they were clearing the debris out of the canal Welshpool Borough Council refused the use of the tipful material removed from the canal, but a local farmer called W. Davis offered the use of his land. Remember when I said the weather was absolutely beautiful? Uh, this doesn't look good. As I mentioned in the last video, they need to make nature reserves every so many miles, and this is the nature reserve for this section. So, typically, um, it's tipped it down for us. Um, it's literally tipping it down, this wasn't in the forecast. We did say it was going to be showers, but this looks like more than a shower. So we're underneath the bridge here, which is a new road bridge, um, because that used to go to a mill down there, um, which we turned into a nature reserve. And this is the rest of the navigation, so it's going to be a really, really hard um, turn to just come down here. Um, but we're going to stay in here until hopefully this shower goes over, because it's really heavy. Um, and we don't want to be walking in that. We've got no waterproofs, because yeah, we thought it wasn't going to be whales, but it, I thought it wasn't going to be raining, but it is Wales after all. what would be another glorious morning. So, we've right. made it. Yeah, we've made it to Be Bellin, Bellin Bridge is just up ahead. And this is Bellin Locks, this is the bottom one. Hmm. Bellin Bottom Lock, got written there. Beautiful this is though, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Um, I can't believe the weather. It's got to be our favourite stretch, isn't it? Yeah, this is absolutely beautiful. Stunning it is. <laughs> um, yeah. It's right, you can walk in front if you want. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> That's just my phone. Just a video. 
We've got a YouTube channel, darling, so we're walking the Monty. Right. <laughs> so yeah. Did you start right at the beginning? Yeah, yeah. yeah. We're on a, on a, we live on an airboat. So we've done the first section, we're, we're at the Western Arm, more there, taking the car. We've done two, two stretches, haven't we? Done two stretches, and this is our third stretch. Oh, right. So. <laughs> but what, a, is this your house? What a beautiful place to live. It's not bad. Oh, it's lovely. Adventure with incessant traffic noise, it never stops. Oh, mm, so yeah. That's the but thing with First the... thing in the morning when it's quiet everywhere else, you yeah. step out the door and Gosh. I know. That's the thing. That's the only thing that ruins it. It's like the main road right there, isn't it? But other than that, it's beautiful. That's not bad. <laughs> well, the path from here to Newtown is pretty good. Oh, that's yeah. good. Thanks, Ellen. Nice to meet you. See ya. <laughs> yeah, so we're at the uh, two... Yeah. Um, Bell and Locks. Two Bell and Locks. But I can't, I can't here, so. believe we were just under... This is bridge 121 ahead of us. Now it's come and up glorious. Isn't yeah, it? 120, we were under the bridge for about a quarter of an hour because it was peeing down with rain. So I've had to take layers off, I had a different jumper on, didn't mm. I? Took my gloves off and it's absolutely glorious now. This section of the canal just feels so remote and rural. It's absolutely breathtaking and silent. And it's about as far as we can get away from that bloody A483. This was a lovely quaint little church by the side of the canal here. I wonder how this ended up in here. This 
has to be the biggest collection of hay I've ever seen. In fact, it's a little bit selfish. Come on, you can't really argue, this is this has to be the most beautiful canal. It's the end of our walk today, isn't it? Yeah, it's the end of our walk. We're at... We're not quite at the end of it. We're at Burra Lock. B-E-R-R-I-E-W. -E I don't think we're saying any of these words right. No, we're probably not, but that's, but, yeah. that's how it's spelled anyway. Sun's setting now. Yeah. Beautiful evening it's turned out to be. Yeah. Absolutely lovely. Light wash uh, lock cottage. Lock, lock cottage? Here next to the lock absolutely stunning oh yeah there's so it. many nice lock cottages along yeah, here there really beautiful. is absolutely beautiful we this has to be my favorite stretch show so far yeah lovely it just keeps getting better and better yeah <laughs> it does mm. it's absolutely beautiful yeah lovely lovely walk today we had yeah we were unlucky a little bit with the weather yeah. but only for about 20 minutes it rained but at least it turned out to be nice in the end but you know but dad's waiting for us now at the next yeah. bridge where we're going to end the walk and then we're going to meet you there next time yeah um this yeah, one two eight. Yeah, be. one two eight. But yeah, thank you very much yeah. for watching, everyone. Please like and subscribe for more Walk of the Montgomery. Um, hope you're enjoying this series so far. Yeah, hope so. Um, we yeah. we loved it. Yeah, absolutely Actually beautiful. We just not, want everyone it's our else. Our favourite now. It's just Jamie can't. Yeah, we're hoping button. this these video series will get more attention for the Montgomery and hopefully. Yeah. Um, speed things up a bit because it's absolutely it's probably the yeah. most beautiful canal it honestly we found is out. i haven't done all the canals yet but we found out in the budget mm. we found out in the budget uh, one of our subscribers informed us that they've been accepted for a 16 million pound fund yeah so yeah. it's another 16 million pound going towards the restoration of this canal yeah so which is really good I think that's from, I don't know the name, that's a really long name and it's um, Welsh. It's the border of England and Wales. Yeah. Let's just say that. Um, Up into um, Welshport. Yeah. 
But yeah, we hope you all enjoyed. Yeah. Please like and subscribe. Um, Become a patron if you like. Yeah, because you get to see everything 24 hour early access um, and exclusive content. Yeah. Um, I think that's that's it. Yeah, see you later, right, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.